Lately, I've been auditioning for a lot of different voice acting roles, and while doing so, I tend to ad-lib different parts. This is a compilation of my favorite ad-lib lines I've been doing recently. Just get out of my home right now! Like, now, like, walk out of the door! Like, here is you, and here is where you should be doing, and this is where you should be going! Like, leave! And why are you here? Actually, you know what? Just get out of my home! Like, right now, please! This is kind of freaking me out a little bit. So Darby got her things and left ten minutes early and left me alone with five tables that I had to cook for. Fuck you too, Darby! Adrian, you don't just eat people. That's wrong. A Adrian? Adrian? Adrian, no. No, 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 no. He has so much to live for. I mean, come on. He's tall and, and he has brown hair, apparently. I mean, I'm just making him up, but he has so much to live for. He could become a doctor or something. I mean, no, not a doctor. Well, he, he could probably be a, a gas station attendant. No. No, he's, he's going to be a rapist. What, what, gee golly, I, I guess just eat him then. Adrian, no, no, he has so much to live for. I mean, I mean, he's American. At least he's not British. We're shit. We're the worst. At least he's not Italian. That's even worse. No, that's a horrible joke. Moving on. Um, So much to live for. He could be a bagel maker or something. What's a bagel maker? Well, don't ask me, but he could be one. He could be the first bagel maker. That's a lot to live for. And you already ate him. God damn it, Adrian. No, he doesn't say god damn it. 1926. Uh, what is. No, what is 19. Speakeasy, Adrian. <laughs> the only 1920 thing. Flappers, Adrian. I don't know what 1926. I'm gonna Google it. Hold on. Adrian, you don't just eat people. That's balled up. Don't take any wooden nickels. Adrian, no, no, he has so much to live for. He could be a real dumb guy for all you know. You're beautiful when you're angry. Wow. You're even gorgeous when you're punching me. Please, don't be mad. I promise not to sleep at the edge of your bed anymore. Your dreams just smell like sunshine. I promise. I'm not stalking you. I'm just following you around and keeping wreckage of your behaviors because I love you. That's not weird. I know I just met you, but you're really cute, and this is a manga, so do you want to be my love interest? Hi. I'm the cold and distant type that later has character development that is generally underwhelming. Maybe you can melt my icy heart with your fiery love, but probably not. Hi. I'm Soon. The British accent helps add to my mysterious persona. Also, I'm mean. Grr. Do you know what love tastes like? It tastes like sweat, blood, and some very tight ropes. Would it be weird if I licked the inside of your ear? I didn't think so. Your breath smells like anticipation. Ruby, shut up and listen for once. Ruby, shut up and listen for once. I say Sapphire's a black man. Mm-hmm. I'm not sure where I got the name Necromancer from. I'm more accustomed to killing people than bringing them back. In fact, I'd probably kill people to bring them back just to kill them again. Actually, that kind of sounds like fun. Largo is a little creeped out right now. Largo needs to be honest. Largo just peed himself a little bit. That kind of sounds like fun. Guys, I think I'm going to become a necromancer. Largo is still a little creeped out. <laughs> That's a uh, burp bending for all my Avatar friends out there. Well, that's just disgusting. Uh, scary man, Lego run. I'm not that scary. I just said I want to kill people, bring them back to life, and kill them again. Oh. Still sounds like fun. I like titties. I like titties. I like titties. I like titties. I like titties, motherfucker. <laughs> Titties! I don't know. You think that's enough? I'll do another one. I like titties! That was weird. I'm gonna, hold on. Let me do a different one. I like titties. Mmm. Titties. I just wanna suck on them and I like mm, titties. Oh. I like titties, motherfucker. Man.